Hey pups, Arby here. Are you an otaku? Do you have friends who are otakus? Do you know someone who's an otaku? A family member? A potential love partner? A pet? Don't know what to get them for Christmas this year? Well, I'm here to help. I myself am an otaku. And after doing some research on my own, here's some great gifts to give to your fellow otaku. Links to the websites are in the description. Be sure to check those out because I can't take all the credit here. That being said, let's begin! Starting off with one of the obvious choices here. Okay, there's a lot of things involving DVDs and Blu-rays here, but I'm kind of pointing out the obvious. If you notice your fellow otaku has a love for anything anime, then you found the first perfect gift. A DVD Blu-ray of Wolf Children? Bingo! A DVD box set of Black Butler? Perfection! An entire DVD collection of Studio Ghibli films? Pure anime love! Trust me, when people hear the word otaku, two things that come to mind firsthand are anime and manga. Just pay attention to the types of anime they like, and I'm sure they'll love you for getting them their favorite anime series. Speaking of which... Again, putting out the obvious, manga is a huge part of the otaku community. Weeble babies like myself enjoy classic manga, and it can be any kind of manga from any type of fandom, from Dragon Ball to Black Butler to even Pokemon, and other games like Kirby and Crash Bandicoot for goodness sake. Manga can work out as a perfect gift, just like with anime DVDs and box sets. But there's different types of manga otakus can enjoy. Like with anime, you just have to look carefully and pay close attention. If they like hentai, give them a hentai manga. If they like gag mangas, give them a gag manga. If they're into more serious mangas like Black Butler and Tokyo Ghoul, Give them those types of mangas. Once again, like with anime, and as said earlier, pay close attention and understand their likes and interests in certain types of manga. This seems pretty obvious. Again, like with manga and anime, pay close attention to what they like. If they're a huge Tokyo Ghoul fan, Tokyo Ghoul themed clothes. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball themed clothes. Black Butler, Black Butler themed, you get the picture. And it doesn't end there. Accessories are also very important. You can find a bunch of them on Hot Topic's website or on Amazon. Look at the Sailor Moon backpack! And don't get me started on the adorable looking Agretsuko pillow. You all probably saw this coming. Studio Ghibli is a big part of the anime, manga, weeaboo, otaku community. Totoro backpack, No Face coin bank, Panyo themed dresses, Kiki's jewelry, Studio Ghibli postcards, you name it. If your fellow otaku is a fan of Studio Ghibli, and likes a handful of these movies I mentioned, or likes everything Studio Ghibli, then you're on the right track. Or if they have a specific favorite Ghibli movie they love to death, make sure you get them the right one, and they'll love it. And they'll not only love it, but love you to death. I know I'm a huge Ghibli fangirl, and Lord knows I love anything Studio Ghibli themed. Trust me, you can't go wrong with Studio Ghibli films. Another part of the otaku community are the Japanese themed lunchboxes, aka bento boxes. A lot of them are found on Amazon, and the majority of the lunchboxes and accessories are themed with Pokemon, Studio Ghibli, Dragon Ball, and possibly other anime, but the accessories that go with the lunchboxes are either sold separately or make it more expensive, such as the themed chopsticks and cutlery and food containers. You can find bento boxes at your local supermarket, Walmart, or Target if you're looking for cheaper options, but no bento lunch would be complete without a bento recipe book. You can find the books at a local bookstore like Books A Million, Barnes & Noble, or you could order it off of Amazon. And it could be anything your fellow otaku desires. Pokemon, Hello Kitty, if they're a Hello Kitty fan, maybe Dragon Ball, anything they desire. This may come as a shock to most people, but if the otaku you're trying to find gifts for is a Sailor Moon fan and loves makeup, this gift is for them. Eyeshadow, blush, mascara, lip gloss, even makeup brushes. Sailor Moon brings her saying Moon of Prism Power Makeup to life with this lovely collection. Found on either Amazon or Hot Topic. Anime art books are probably a big thing when it comes to finding gifts for otakus. Any anime they're a huge fan of. Dragon Ball, Sailor Moon, Black Butler, Studio Ghibli, any and all anime is worth giving to them. Because the artwork of almost any anime ever is beautiful. Or heck, even how to draw anime books. While not the best source for those who are in the art community and are also an otaku, it's still a pretty good start. Hey, we all gotta start somewhere. Whether you're finding them at the local supermarket or grocery store, 
or local Easter market that sells specialized food and snacks from Asian countries, a snack box subscription, anime and Asian themed snacks are the top of anyone's list. Pocky and Star Candy is being the top number one alongside Kit Kats. Yes, there's Kit Kats imported from Japan. I tried a few myself and I personally like the matcha Kit Kats. They're actually pretty delicious. Action figures, blind bag keychains, blind bag items in general, anime Funko Pop figures, plushies, any collectible item you can think of that's anime or manga themed at all is a perfect gift for any otaku. Whether it's a regular subscription or premium, from Crunchyroll, Funimation, any subscription level from any anime streaming service is the number one perfect gift to give to your fellow otaku. My father gave me a subscription to Crunchyroll once, and even though I hardly ever use it, I go in there to watch whatever animes I want to watch from time to time. Though, I do prefer dub over sub because I can't watch and read at the same time. Also, I'm rusty on my Japanese. Folkloid stuff. Figures, clothes, accessories, stickers, music, anything Folkloid is another perfect gift for your otaku. If they're a Folkloid fan, that is. Woo! That was a lot to go through. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video and if it helps you find the perfect gift for your fellow otaku, be sure to let me know in the comments. Cue the outro. RP is out. Peace!